morning, good morning, good morning. <laughs> Happy Thanksgiving, y'all. <laughs> I'm about to go out here and cook. The only part, I'm only cooking fish today. I'm, I'm going to cook my Thanksgiving on Sunday because I got to go back and get my cousin from uh, Columbus. She stayed with her friend, so I got to get up out of here early Saturday morning to go pick her up. And me and my dad, we will have a blog for you guys. Um, so, well, today um, I did a... Um, uh, a thing and they wanted me to do a blog um, talk about um, people that are in open relationships you, this is your video for y'all y'all the ones that want to talk about this I, I didn't want to touch this subject but since so many people said to bring it up I said okay so we're going to talk about it and this will be a series first of all ladies and gentlemen if you are insecure and weak you are not built for an open relationship because your insecurities will become a, a play here okay I want y'all to understand that if you weak and you uh, see someone prettier comes along, you are not built for this because uh, your 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 feelings is going to come in and then you're going to become a stalker. It's not uh, advisable. I see this all the time. <clears throat> you have to be a strong minded individual to walk in uh, uh, polygamy. I'm serious. Only the strong survive. And then then when fights and stuff break out because someone prettier comes along, somebody that can uh, that's better sexually than you. That all come to uh, plays a key in all of that plays on, you know, uh, people's self-esteem. You know, I've seen people that have gotten hurt very bad uh, in open relationships. Really bad things have happened. Because of jealousy and envy. It's sad. It really is sad. So y'all got to y'all got to be very careful when y'all uh, opening yourself up to this uh, sexual perversion. Very careful because it's not it's not nothing to play with. You open yourself up to demonic forces, spirits. Having sex with different multiple partners. God didn't intend it to be like that. And I've, that's something that I've learned. Because you open yourself up. To uh, un, um, forces and then it, it, it messes with your mental. I don't want the karma behind that. It's a lot of karma behind being sexual, uh, sexual promiscuity. And what you need to deal with is uh, with your childhood wounds. Molestation. That's, that's the number one key in people that are sexually promiscuous. Is sexual molestation, sexual uh, abuse, mental abuse, psychological abuse. So y'all stay tuned for uh, part two. Part two. Y'all have a happy Thanksgiving. Gobble, gobble. Family first.